Hi everybody. I've been um, fooling around with some iCAD cards and uh, I have uh, made quite a few now. I don't know if I'm up to the 61 yet that you're supposed to have. But uh, Anyways, um, I thought I'd do one on film or two, whatever I can get done here. I will um, show you the things that I've been doing. I, I did this one, which I just finished. I did this one here. I did some very simple ones. My biggest problem is finding quotes. Um, I need to go on the internet, I guess, and find some quotes that you can stick on these things. This one is just a background. I have no idea. <sighs> I kind of ruined it. <laughs> well, you make mistakes, too. Now, these I got from... Um, they are color cards. Do I have any here? Yes. These color cards and you color them up and I just made um, iCADs out of them so no special um, kind of coloring I just colored them just plain and uh, I think they turned out just fine I'm not really not into Copic markers like everybody else is uh, I just I don't have the knack for it for some reason I have no idea why, but, and I do have little quotes on these, so that's kind of what I've been working on so far, and um, I got this paper from uh, a romance novel, I love that paper, and um, I thought that I would make a couple of iCAD cards out of it. And how's everybody been doing? Uh, I know I haven't been on too much lately and I keep saying that I'm going to change that but I hate when my glue doesn't come out. Uh, actually they put me on some new pills and I'm feeling a little better which is good. Um, I do have stage 5 kidney damage, which is not good, but I'm not on dialysis yet, so that I guess is a good thing, although they tell me I'm pretty close, but you seem to have uh, no energy. This is uh, probably why I haven't been down here. This is my basement where my craft room is and uh, I guess I got black all over my hands oh yeah so I do and uh, I'm mostly so tired that I can't seem to do anything but like I said they put me on some new pills and I'm definitely feeling better because I'm down here doing some crafting, which is very cool. Okay. Now I want to cut that. This is kind of, I've been watching a lot of YouTube, as always, and uh, still a lot of haul videos. I wish I lived in the States. I think the store you have Tuesday morning is a great store. I see people getting all kinds of deals and stuff. Canada, we don't even have that. I even think your Michaels is different. I've seen people get um, grab bags and all this kind of stuff and <laughs> we don't have any of that here at all, which is not so good never get no deals for sure 
Um, these are little cards I'm kind of cutting up to put on here. I miss a few people. Uh, Aaron from um, No, I just can't think. Imperfect, imp imperfect impulses. I don't know where he's gone to. I know he's going to school. I haven't seen any videos from him lately. I kind of like the guy videos. It gives you a different um, perspective on things. Us girls, we do all kinds of feminine things, but these guys do a few masculine things. And uh, I think that's cool. Okay, now I kind of want to do the same thing that I just did on that other card, I think. But I want to do something to the background on this. I don't know what. Let me try these. Um, what these distress crayons from uh, Tim Holtz? And I don't use them very much, and I don't know why. But um, we're going to. Oh, keeping frame here. Uh, they are kind of cool. Where's my water? Now here's the other thing. When you uh, aren't crafting for a while, you forget where everything is. There's my water. No, oh, that's kind of cool. Hmm. Very cool. I like that. Uh, let me dry this. I'm making noise. I guess not too much new and exciting. Uh, we've been out in the boat a lot. My uh, husband always wanted a pontoon boat. It's like being in your living room. Actually, it is like being in your living room on water. We really like it. So, we've been doing a lot of that. Hmm. Now that I've done that one, maybe I'll try something else. Um. I'm just going to try to put a little dark on one side. And it's fun. We're um, just on a man-made lake right now with the boat because both of us have never had a boat before. And uh, so we're experimenting. Learning how to drive it actually is more like it. But it doesn't go very fast. It's not like a speed boat. Um, I think it only goes about 10 miles an hour. But it's great for going up and down the lake and being on the water. And my kids go swimming from it, so that's cool. Alright, I'm going to dry that. kind of like that lighter color a little bit. Now I pressed a little darker on that. I 
I still want to kind of see the background, so this is kind of a cool thing. I need some circles or something. Okay, let me dry that. One thing I like about Tim Holtz, uh, these dryers, they're not real noisy. I've got a couple of other ones that are real, real, real noisy. I have another video before this one, won't you? Put on. Now. Well, I like that. Wondering, I haven't used these very much. I don't know why. They seem to be all right. Now I want to stick some of these on. And I'm just going to use my uh, tiny and I've been using uh, distress ink on my little stamps. Oops. You are my garden of friends, which is kind of nice. And I have this uh, Uh, this is silks, and it is nutmeg, and um, just um, putting a little bit on a dauber, and just kind of pressing it down to make some circles. Okay. Now I want to highlight this. And I'm going to use one of these markers. Just kind of rubbing it in. I go through a lot of these baby weeps just because I really can't stand to get my hands dirty, so that drives me nuts. <laughs> okay, there's my finished card. Cool. Very dark. I'm into dark lately. Well, I shouldn't say that. Okay. Now here's one of these um, little cards that I've been using that I colored up. Now the thing is, for these, is I have to try to put um, 
some kind of background in there. And since I'm using these, oh. I might as well try out a few more. I know everybody, I see that Tim Holtz has got, and I have to get this, um, a crazy dog set out. You know how he has a crazy birds and all that stuff. I've got the crazy cats and I've got the um, crazy birds. Now i got to get the dogs. I haven't seen it. Sorry, all my stuff just fell down here. Uh, online anywhere but then I haven't really been looking but um, okay so now we need a background color and I have a green in there and red and yellow and white and I'm really liking teal lately. I don't know why, but it's becoming my favorite color. Well, it always, whoops, always was my favorite color. I don't know what I'm talking about. Okay, so I'm going to put some color around this card in various places. Sometimes I just like to scribble. I was noticing a lot of times uh, we get too carried away with our stuff. We start off and it looks great and then we keep adding and adding and adding and adding and pretty soon before you know it you have... No, that's not good. I got black on my finger and I don't want that. This is just a card stock, so it's not a... And this is not blending too well. Alright, for what I want. Trying to feel the card coming off paper. Well, let me dry that and see what it looks like. Exactly the car, the look I'm looking for. Let's try a different color blue. Ooh, a little darker. Hmm. I 
Actually, I think I like that better. I don't need to fill the whole card up. Yeah, I kind of like that. Now these are simple to do. I guess you're just painting the card. And uh, I mean you can use water paints. I've been using markers on these. Uh, but you can use anything to color them with. Okay, now uh, I need a little sentiment on there. I'll try this one because I need something small. And that says, uh, planting love. Now, I've already highlighted these with black pen when I first did them. And, uh, I had... I'm just going to do the little, I don't know what they call these pictures, I guess. I don't really want to do the flowers. put a little black on it, make it stand out a little more, give it some pop. We don't want to hear that word. Just make it stand out more. Okay, then I need to put some border around it, which I always for some reason don't do. I think I get more on my hands than I do on a card, but I'm 
There we go. Okay. That is a couple of iCAD cards that I've done today. I hope you enjoyed my video. And uh, I'll be making some more. I want to do some jelly printing too. I've been watching that and it looks so neat. I have a jelly print um, plate and I have never used it. Surprise, surprise. And so um, I uh, really want to try that and see how it turns out. And I will be continuing on to do this tonight. I've got two more cards that... Uh, this one I screwed up. I tried to put silver on it and it took the whole flower out. Maybe I can salvage it, I don't know. But I have a couple more cards that I'm going to play around with tonight and um, see how they turn out. Thanks again for watching. Please subscribe. Um, now that I'm feeling a little better, I'll be doing a bunch of stuff. Um, I want to do some die cuts and I have a silhouette that I never use, so I'm going to try to get that up and working and uh, print off some die cuts. So uh, keep in touch. Keep watching. Bye.